For creating the background, we need an A3 paper. Draw a line around this part. And then connect the lines. Turn around your paper into portrait. This part will be the bigger part. It's going to be the sky. And the bottom part that is smaller, it's going to be the ground or the table. For the sky part, you are going to get a smaller paper. It can be a white A4 paper. And you are going to draw some objects that is on the sky. For example, I'm going to draw a cloud. You can do some birds if you like. Once you're done drawing, now you can cut your shapes. To make it easier, you can like try to make them smaller first, like one piece. And then you can hold it and then cut it easily. Now you have this cutting piece of clouds and then birds and other else. Right now, I want you to arrange it. Where do you want it to be? For example, the birds will be here and the clouds is going to be around here. Okay. For coloring the sky, you are going to use chalk. So if you like to be like a sunset color, you can use these three colors of sunset. And if you want to be like a daylight, you can use this blue, light blue and dark blue. So I'm going to pick the light blue. I want to be a daylight. So I'm going to keep it aside here and then use this blue. Let's see. I'm going to use light blue for the bottom part of the sky so I'm going to just color scratch it around it like this and then you can stop and hold this piece this cutting piece of your clouds then we are going to use your finger to smudge the chalk For the area that is close to the cloud, you can hold this cloud and then you can color around this cloud. And with your finger again, you are going to smudge around the chalk, going outside like that. Push it around, push it outside. And make sure the paper is not moving okay don't leave your paper stay right here and then do it again you can also do it at the bottom part if you like So when you open, when you leave the paper of the cloud, it's going to be like this. Wow! It's nice, right? Put it aside and then we are going to continue in our next shape here.
Yay, you've made it. So this is an example of a daylight. If you want to do like sunset, this one is my example of a sunset. It's do the same thing like the first one and then you just change the color. The same thing, which one that you like better. Our next step is we are going to paint the ground part. 